Hi, everybody. My name is Spencer. I am part of the Earlham Theatre College Epic Advantage class. I adapted the script from Kate's novel. And it's devised, which means it's basically created by all of us that you see here. And then Sarah and I will be leading our Epic Advantage program to Scotland. Basil, find out who our visitor is, where he came from, and how he got into my house. Think Firefly meets all the things you know about steampunk meets the Lord of the Rings. Am I dead? No. Would you like to be? I was mostly interested in the gender roles of the world of Arnica. They're highly gendered. Women wear skirts, men wear pants. Because fantasy and science fiction normally are not very women-centric. Every man, woman, and child in a five-mile radius is under my protection. And it's interesting that Kate was able to create a world where women do have agency. She creatively picked not, like, mainstream creatures, which I was like, yes, that's cool. Hold on, Daisy! We're riding a really, really big bird! <laughs> so in the construction of our lovely bird, this is actually two different patterns. Uh, the beak portion is styled off of a plague doctor mask, mm -hmm. and the head portion is modeled after a raven. I use two different synthesizers to make the blaster sound which you will hear in our old demos later. Whoa! <laughs> What was that for? A show that needs to like travel so easily, we didn't want to like lug around a bunch of heavy set pieces. So our actors are our set. Doors, we have hallways. We have so many things that we need people to not be people for. So that was a problem because we had people, not things. Well, how do we put an airship on stage and how do we make it fly? We did a lot of workshopping using fabric and umbrellas. If she adds weight, it looks like I'm trying to get through like a really small space. Up, up and away, we've never rode a single day. Up, up, Initially, I was like, this would be fun to sing while we're going down the Royal Mile in Scotland. Um, and then Lynn was like, what if we sang them as transitions? I was like, okay. <laughs> we need to constantly try it, talk about it, fix it, try it again. It's a hard challenge, but it's really just about being kind to each other. I said it was too soon to know if we had feelings for one another, but he said, I'm a very lovely person and you could do worse. And he was right. People should come to see the show because it's a delightful nerd fest. It's cute, it's dorky, it's goofy, it does not take itself seriously. Because it's fun. It's funny, it's heartwarming. If you have any interest at all in fantasy or sci-fi, you're going to adore this. It's the world premiere, guys.